Awesome, Pisces. Awesome. So, um, what we see is in the past that there was a lot of inaction. You could have lost passion for something or someone. There was a lack of spark in a connection, or there was just someone who had a lot of passion but they were holding back. Okay, could be someone who was very impulsive and reckless in their ways and attitude. Could be dealing with a younger fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Right now. You're doing you, okay? You're happy. You're content. Could be someone who's in a marriage situation or could be someone who's in a long-term commitment. Very, very happy. Could be involving kids. Why this is happening is because of the Nine of Pentacles, Pisces. You realize your self-worth, okay? This is uh, taking care of yourself, you're doing your hair. You could have been dealing with someone who could have been in and out of your life. Doesn't have to be. But there was someone who was very, very impulsive around you, okay? Right now, you're being single, independent. Even if you're not single, even if you're in a relationship or a marriage, you're being very, very self-sufficient, okay? You're uh, not being needy. You're living the best life. You're on your own. You're, you're someone who's who can stand their ground. You're focused on yourself and your money, okay? This is realizing a lot of self-worth and value, okay? Of your mind, body, and soul. Okay, you're you're just. I'm loving it. All right. What's on your mind is could be a water sign, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. But Knight of Cups in Reverse is someone to me who is emotionally shut off. Okay, could be someone manipulative, but I feel this is someone who's not offering their emotions anymore. Um. <clears throat> again, again, it feels like someone who's in and out of your life, or this is just. Could be an offer that you're not accepting or there's just no forward moment in your love life. Uh, but uh, it could be someone who's just not offering their emotions, okay? Could be someone jealous who's on your mind or um, take it how it resonates. Why is all this happening? The reason for the reading is because of the star. Someone sees you as the star or you are the star of someone's life or you are having a lot of faith and hope in the divine, okay? This is waiting for the right time. You're, you're, like I said, right, uh, time is fluid. So if you're not in a, a, a contented relationship, in a committed relationship, then this will be happening, okay? Like time is fluid. This could have happened, is happening, or will happen. So take it how it resonates. You're shut off emotionally, but this is what you want. You want your 10 of cups, okay? And if you want your 10 of cups, you're realizing, I'm going to have to have a lot of faith and a lot of hope in this connection in the universe and things are going to happen at the right time in the divine timing okay coming into the current future you will be experiencing the seven of cups in reverse a lot of clarity if there was a lot of confusion in your relationship or a connection or just overall in a situation you're going to gain clarity okay if someone's kept their emo if someone's uh, kept their options open they're going to clarify their emotions they're going to come narrow their options and they're going to one on on something all right this is clarity on something that was a lot of wishful thinking or just a lot of confusion all right awesome overall energy bottom of the deck we have the three of cups all right I think the Three of Cups is, uh, yes, it could be chilling, it could be dating, it could be having fun. But because I see the Ten of Cups here and the Nine of Cups, Nine of Pentacles here, someone's being single. If they're not, then this is just the vibes that someone's giving, okay? Even if it's not the vibes, it is just someone who realizes I am worth much more than what I'm getting. And to do that, I am going to just be happy on my own. I am okay with a relationship. I am okay without a relationship. I love it. All right. Three of Cups can also be a reconciliation. Let's see. Let's see how this plays out. Glad that the Three of Cups here for Pisces. Why is the Three of Cups here for Pisces? Glad for the Three of Cups. What is this Three of Cups? All right. Someone who is single is wanting to be in a relationship with Pisces. Why am I loving your reading so much? Is it because I'm a Pisces too? Someone wants a reconciliation, reunion, and there's someone who's coming in. The justice just flew out. I'm still going to take it. There was an imbalance and unfairness in a situation. Could be someone who was single, but now they want a relationship. They're being needy. They're being clingy. You know why? Because Pisces is the nine of pentacles. They're like, I'm okay. I don't need you. I'm okay. But there's someone coming in with the reconciliation. Why? Because in the past, there could have been someone who things were just not fair. Okay. Uh, clarify the justice in reverse. 
that's Libra and fly for the justice in reverse. Yeah, because someone thought something wasn't fair. There was someone who was probably putting in all the effort and things were not balanced. And also because of the Empress in reverse, someone stopped creating a connection. Someone stopped nurturing a, a connection because there was a lack of growth and expansion. Okay, something was just not fair and someone just pulled away. Okay, and now someone wants a reconciliation. Someone wants a reunion. Now for the Knight of Wands in reverse. Why is the Knight of Wands in reverse? Is it past for Pisces? Yeah. Someone stopped taking action. Someone lost uh, the connections. Uh, someone lost passion in a connection. You know what? Five of Wands in reverse is someone who is avoiding drama or avoiding any kind of conflicts that brings drama to their life. Okay? Someone's like, fuck it. I am not working in this anymore. I don't want any drama in my life. Or maybe this is just not worth pursuing. Bye bye. Five for the Five of Wands in reverse. Yeah. And that is stressing the shit out of someone. If I forgot to say, sometimes I say bad words. If it offends you, heart left. But I hope you stay. Someone's stressing over this because you're not fighting for this connection anymore. You're not putting in that effort. You're not putting in the action anymore. Because you're so focused on yourself, Pisces. Clap for the Ten of Cups here. Why is the Ten of Cups here as the, overall, as the current situation for Pisces? Yeah. You could be keeping your options open, Spices. Either you're keeping your options open or there's someone here because you're so focused on yourself. There's someone here um, who uh, could be thinking of ways to approach. Maybe you're like, how am I supposed to get this 10 of cups? Or maybe there's someone else in your life who wants this 10 of cups with you because you're portraying yourself as very confident, as very secure, financially abundant, like I'm okay on my own, I don't need you. And now someone's looking at how to approach the situation because you shut them out, Pisces. Clap for the seven of cups here. Clap for the seven of cups, please. Yeah. Someone's manifesting you back, Pisces. Could be a Virgo or a Gemini. The magician is someone who is amazing at manifesting. They manifest, they take action, they're very powerful. They feel they have everything that they need to make things work out. And this person is manifesting the ten of cups with you, buddy. Clarify the Nine of Pentacles, please. Clarify the Nine of Pentacles. Yeah. And someone's losing their shit because you're good on your own, Pisces. Could be dealing with the Sagittarius. With the Temperance in Reverse, someone's batshit crazy. All right. This person's like, what I do? What I do? What I do? They're like probably like almost outside your gates trying to sneak on you. Okay. They are going nuts. Losing their patience. They want... They, they, they just cannot wait. Time for the temperance in reverse. Yeah. They want things to change with the Wheel of Fortune. They want big changes happening, okay? There are big changes coming up for you, Pisces. This person, whoever's losing their shit, you're doing you. And there are big changes coming up. Things are going to be in your favor. Or this person just is going so crazy because they want things to change. They want huge shifts, okay? They want changes to come in their life. They want the Wheel of Fortune to change in their way. Time for the Wheel of Fortune. Yeah, but someone's stuck in their head. They want to move things forward. They want things to change. But with the temperance in reverse, they're losing their shit. They're losing their patience. But then at the same time, they're, they're stuck. Because they're stuck in their head about something with fear. They have a lot of fear about something. The Eight of Swords, to me, is someone who... Who, who is in a self-inflicted prison, okay? They make their own prison, okay? They, they, they tie their hands, they're blindfolded, and they don't want to see things for what they are, okay? They just want to make thoughts and scenarios in their head that don't really exist. So I have the Knight of Cups in Reverse. Why is the Knight of Cups in Reverse on Pisces' mind? So I have the Knight of Cups in Reverse. Yeah. You're shut down, but you know what's happening, Pisces. You're such a badass. With a high priestess, that's Pisces or Cancer. You're extremely intuitive, but you're giving someone the silent treatment, okay? But you know they're coming. You know they're coming. You're just giving them a piece of what you are. Clap for the high priestess. Yeah. And now you've kept someone waiting. All right. You're going to take, you're not taking any action towards this person. That's Pisces, the hangman. You're taking your own time on your mind. You're like, you know what? I'm going to take my own, my own time. I'm going to sit here back on my throne and you're coming to me. The silent treatment's working just for the Pisces who's giving silent treatment to someone. Clarify the star, please. Why is the star here? Yeah. Because you have so much faith and hope, either you have faith, Pisces, or the person you're dealing with has a lot of faith uh, in this connection and the divine timing. You have faith and there's someone rushing in. Knight of Swords could be an air energy. Prayer, sleep, Gemini. Someone's rushing in and they have 
a lot to say. Can I put the Knight of Swords, please? Yeah, they could be holding on to you with the Four of Pentacles. Sorry for the Four of Pentacles. They're not letting you go. Yeah, but someone's ignoring. They could have been ignoring or avoiding a situation. They were not decisive earlier. They were, But they were still holding on to you. Or they were holding back from communicating whatever they have to say. Clive of the Seven of Cups in reverse. What is the Seven of Cups in reverse? Yeah. Someone's very clear. But clear about a situation that there is definitely unfinished business. Because there is a lack of closure between you and this person. You could be dealing with it at a distance from this person. Clive of the World in reverse. Yeah. You could be dealing with an air sign. Someone cold. I see. Detached. But whoever this person is who's had a realization, they feel that things are very, very clear. I know what my options are. I've narrowed down my options. And you and me, we're unfinished business. Okay. Clap for the King of Swords in reverse. Who is this King of Swords in reverse? Yeah. But you are shut down with a fool in reverse. You're not taking the sleep of faith because you have gone through back and hell. And now you're not trusting this person. King of Swords in reverse could be a liar, a cheater, someone very, very manipulative. And you're like, you know, and, and probably this person is not even communicating with you or there is a lack of communication between you both. But yeah, someone cold, I see detached and you're like, you know what? No, I'm not taking this risk with you anymore. You may have been very clear about what you want, but I am not clear and I don't want it. The reason for the reading is the, with the hope and faith, right? Someone's rushing in because you're taking your own time and you have faith that things will happen in the divine timing. Universe is sending them in. This person, when they open their mouth with the Knight of Swords, they have so much to say, okay? They're just going to be blunt, sharp, okay? They're going to rush in, say what they want and leave, all right? This person could be holding back from you for a very long time, all right? And that's why they could have been stuck in their head. With the Two of Swords, someone's blocking their heart chakra, like in a shutdown mode. Clarify um, the Two of Swords, please. Yeah, because you were emotionally cold, so this was you. You were prob you probably had to make a decision. You were holding back. So they're rushing in to communicate with you. And you're just emotionally unavailable with the Queen of Cups in reverse. You could have been very emotional with this person, but this time you're not taking an emotional approach to the situation. The Queen of Cups is going to think from her head for the first time. Not being compassionate, etc. Clap for the hangman. Clap for the hangman. Yeah, with the hangman, you've withdrawn. You've withdrawn from this connection. I have two withdrawn connections. We have the high priestess, which is again silent treatment. The hermit, which is again withdrawing from the connection, retreating, isolation, okay? You've completely stopped talking to this person. Like I said, this is someone... You're showing a lot of strength with the Leo. You're you're taming the situation. You're like, you know what? I'm not opening up this time. I'm not opening up this time. You can stress the fuck out of this, but I'm not. Clap for the Empress in reverse. Clap for the Empress in reverse. Yeah. You're not feeling this connection. And whoever's coming in wants a reconciliation. They want a relationship with you. Because you're not feeling this connection, there's someone who's going nuts. Okay. With the Temperance in reverse and the Four of Swords in reverse, there's someone who's restless about a situation and they cannot stop stressing about you with the Nine of Swords. Cannot stop thinking about the situation with the Four of Swords in reverse. And they're going crazy with the Temperance in reverse. Alright, Pisces, I am loving it. And uh, I hope you enjoyed this reading. Hope it resonates. Leave your comments below. Like, share, follow, subscribe. And I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.